Hey there! My name is Pharmacist Michael, and welcome to my channel. Today we're diving into the dreamy world of sleep and the medication that's sometimes called a little helper in that department. Tamazepam. Whether you're a night owl struggling to catch some Z's, or just curious about how this medication works, you're in the right place. Let's dim the lights and get into it, shall we? So, what exactly is temazepam? Well, temazepam is part of a group of medication known as benzodiazepines, which are often prescribed to help people sleep. Yep, it's your friendly neighborhood sedative, helping you drift off into dreamland when counting sheep just doesn't cut it. Temazepam is FDA approved for one main thing, treating insomnia. Specifically, it's great for those of us who have trouble falling asleep or staying asleep throughout the night. It's usually prescribed for short-term use because while it can be super effective, it's not meant to be a long-term fix for sleep problems. But wait, before you jump straight into using temazepam, there are some things you might want to try first. We all know that good sleep is the key to feeling our best, but sometimes it's just so hard to come by. Here are a few natural sleep tips that could help you get those precious Z's without needing a prescription. Stick to a sleep schedule. Go to bed and wake up at the same time every day, even on weekends. Your body loves routine. And this can help regulate your internal clock. Create a relaxing bedtime routine. Wind down with activities like reading, taking a warm bath, or listening to soothing music. Keep it consistent so your brain knows it's time to sleep. Watch what you eat and drink. Avoid large meals, caffeine, and alcohol close to bedtime. These can disrupt your sleep or make it harder to fall asleep in the first place. Optimize your sleep environment. Make sure your bedroom is cool, quiet, and dark. Investing in a comfortable mattress and pillows can also make a big difference. Limit screen time. The blue light from phones, tablets, and TVs can interfere with your ability to fall asleep. Try to turn off devices at least an hour before bed. Exercise regularly. Physical activity can help you fall asleep faster and enjoy deeper sleep. Just make sure not to exercise too close to bedtime, as it might have the opposite effect. Consider nutritional supplements. Some people find that supplements like melatonin, magnesium, or valerian root can help promote relaxation and better sleep. But remember, it's always a good idea to talk to your doctor before adding any new supplements to your routine to ensure they're safe and won't interact with other medications you're taking. If you've tried all of these tips and still find yourself tossing and turning, that's when a medication like temazepam might come into play. But always as a last resort and under your doctor's guidance. Like any medication, Temazepam comes with its own set of side effects. The most common ones are drowsiness and dizziness. Kind of the point, right? But you might also experience headache, nausea, or a bit of a hangover feeling the next morning. There are also some less common side effects like memory problems, confusion, or even feeling restless instead of sleepy. Now, here's where it gets serious. Temazepam can cause some pretty intense side effects in rare cases, like severe allergic reactions or respiratory depression, especially if taken in high doses or mixed with other sedatives. If you notice anything unusual, it's important to talk to your doctor right away. So, who should give temazepam a hard pass? If you have a history of severe respiratory issues like sleep apnea, or if you have myasthenia gravis, this medication might not be for you. It's also not recommended for pregnant or breastfeeding women as it could potentially harm the baby. And if you have a history of substance abuse, temazepam could be a slippery slope. 
so it's crucial to discuss this with your healthcare provider. Temazepam doesn't always play well with others, especially other medications. Mixing it with alcohol, opiates, or other central nervous system depressants can amplify the sedative effects, which can be dangerous. It also interacts with certain antidepressants, antihistamines, and even some over-the-counter cold medicines. So, before starting to mazepam, make sure your doctor knows about everything you're taking, even those herbal supplements. Now for some special considerations. Temazepam is a short-term solution for insomnia, usually prescribed for 7 to 10 days. It's not something you want to take for months on end because it can lead to dependence and tolerance, which means you might need more and more to get the same effect. And when it's time to stop taking it, your doctor will likely taper your dose gradually to avoid withdrawal symptoms. And here's a bedtime tip. Take temazepam only when you have a full seven to eight hours to sleep. If you don't, you might wake up feeling groggy and out of it, which isn't exactly the best way to start your day. Temazepam can be a great tool for helping you catch those precious Zs, but like anything, it's important to use it wisely. If you enjoyed this video and want more content like this, be sure to hit that like button and subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to click the bell so you never miss a new video. Sweet dreams and take care. My name is Pharmacist Michael. Be happy and be healthy.